I've received a lot of requests for this video over the last couple of months, so it's finally here. It's a really simple recipe, only needs a handful of ingredients and can be made ready to eat in 15 minutes. It's so simple, it's so delicious, and it's guaranteed to become a very fast favorite in your family. It's chicken and corn soup on The One Pot Chef. <music> Now, chicken and corn soup is a really, really simple recipe. This is a very shortcut version because I think that when it comes to making a meal at night, it doesn't have to take hours to put together. In fact, this version only takes about 15 minutes and it's using a few things from the fridge and from the cupboard. So first things first, I've sprayed the bottom of our saucepan with a little bit of spray oil, some canola oil. Uh, don't need much, just a little bit. We're gonna toss in two spring onions, which I've just chopped up. Lovely, lovely. I'm also going to add in two rashers or two slices of middle bacon. This is of course optional if you don't like bacon or if you're unable to eat it. You're welcome to leave this out. I just like to add it because it adds an extra dimension of flavour to this soup. But it's perfectly fine without it. So I toss those in. I'm also going to toss in one large breast fillet which I've just chopped up into little chunks. So in that goes. And we're just going to stir this around and cook it over a heat for about two to three minutes. The uh, chicken is starting to get close to cooked, the bacon's releasing a lot of lovely flavours into this along with the onions. Now we're going to toss in one can, 420 grams, of creamed corn. This is a big time saver this one because this adds all that lovely corn and body to the soup. That looks really good there. Lovely. And just stir that through. And we're also going to add in three cups of chicken stock. Oh, that's quietened it down a bit, hasn't it? <laughs> this smells fantastic, by the way. The onion really adds a great dimension to this. So, three cups liquid chicken stock. Just pour it straight in. I didn't use real stock, I used powdered and just put it into some water. I know, cheating, but what are you going to do? So all we're going to do now is stir this, bring it up to the boil, and then turn the heat down and let it simmer for about 10 minutes. This has been simmering away for about 10 minutes and all the chicken and bacon is now nicely cooked. We're ready to add our final ingredient, which is one egg, which I've just beaten up in a cup, and I'm just going to, using the sexy red whisk of death, just going to quickly whisk that through and this will add some lovely thickness to this. I'm just going to whisk it through until the egg is nicely cooked all through it and then we'll be ready to serve. And here we have our finished chicken and corn soup. This smells absolutely amazing and I guarantee you it tastes even better. Just using the spoon here I'll show you how we've got lovely chunks of chicken, bacon and that onion all through it. Absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to have a little taste. Mmm, very hot. Absolutely delicious. You've got that lovely chicken stock sort of flavour with the onion, chunks of chicken there. The onion is really fresh and light because we use a spring onion instead of a regular onion. And the bacon really adds an extra dimension, but as I said before, not essential. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this recipe. All of the ingredients are in the video description and you can check out my other videos at onepotchefshow.com. And until next time, see you later.